Okay, arming and loiter. Low battery, zero percent remaining. Okay, so the first thing that I'd like to uh, demonstrate here is uh, the lock versus follow behavior. So I've got a little uh, scroll wheel on this here link setup to control the yaw of the gimbal. And I've also got this button over here on the right set up to switch between uh, follow and lock. So at the moment, it's set up in uh, follow mode, which means that the gimbal moves with the vehicle. So if I yaw the vehicle, we can see that the gimbal is moving with it. That's the default. And if I switch it into lock mode, then it's now following an earth frame target. So if I move the vehicle, the gimbal does not, does not rotate with it. So you see the legs come into view. All right, uh, next I'm gonna do an auto mission to demonstrate uh, some of the other features. Okay, arming in loiter. Arm. Low and battery. And switching to auto mode. Auto so the first thing it's going to do is climb the 30 meters. And uh, then it's going to uh, do a panorama. So it's going to, yeah, there it is, looking 20 degrees down and backwards. And it's going to rotate at the 20 degrees per second all the way around. And it's going to uh, point north, so forward and north, and then it's going to fly off west. This is a demonstration of the lock. The vehicle is rotating, but the Kimball just stays locked on north. Then what it does is an ROI, so it points down at the ground. It's flying east now. It's kind of locked onto that position. Then it's going to demonstrate that it can also roll the vehicle. So there it is rolled at uh, 20 or 30 degrees to the right and then it'll go to the left and then it's going to RTL. Recenter the camera and RTL. Sorry. 